morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Simplicity is Tea. Before we start, you guys already know what we're about to do. Woo, Jim, look like I'm about to cry. <laughs> Before we start, you guys already know what I'm about to do. Go ahead and pause this video, hit that subscription bell, and hit that notification. Hit the subscription bell. Man, I was doing good. Before, go ahead and pause this video, hit that subscription button, and that notification bell so you can get an update on when I drop another vloggy vlog. But as you guys can tell by the title, we are rating, rating my closet. Yes, y'all, we are ready in my closet today. I'm actually going to pull this up a little bit because I feel like I'm a little low. But yes, y'all, we are actually ready in my closet today. Um, I actually was supposed to... Um, so, the original plan was for me to actually go take pictures and do some BTS for you guys. But it is rainy in Dallas. And I've already did a bunch of BTS for y'all. My bad, y'all. I'm looking for... Oh, here it is. I've already did a bunch of BTS for you guys. So, one of my followers on my Instagram actually gave me this idea. Okay. I cannot find my industrial barbell, y'all. Probably, I'm gonna have to order another one because that was the only one I had. So. But yes, um, one of my followers on my Instagram actually gave me one of this suggestion. Um, they asked me to, well, not even asked me, they was like, hey, how about you do a um, what's in my closet haul or something like that. So this is a what's in my closet rating haul um, because I do have a lot of clothes, y'all. So I'm going to try to make this vlog as lengthy as possible, but not too long because... Baby, we got vlogs to do today. Um, yeah, we got a lot to do today. But let's go ahead and jump. Ooh, damn, stuff be fine. Let's go ahead and jump into this vlog, y'all, and let's get into it, to it, to it. Let's get into it, to it, to it. <laughs> Alright, so the first thing that I'm going to do is jackets. I feel like since that's like the quickest thing that you can put on first, we're going to do jackets. So anybody that knows me, I am a huge fan of sweaters, jackets, coats, all that good jazz. Although I know my grandma, she probably feel like I don't wear coats. <laughs> She's like, where you go then? But I know my grandmother feels like I do not wear coats. However, this, those are like my go-to. So... I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. On this side, I have my coat. Um, I kind of organized this side basically off of um, the seasons, you know, what jacket is more fashionable versus, you know, um, casual. As you guys can see, it's kind of out of order because of Christian, but hey, it is what it is. <laughs> All right, so I think I did a haul on this one before, but I really got a lot. I always get a lot of compliments on this one. A lot of people, I really, I don't have too much. I actually don't have a picture of this jacket on my page, so I'm gonna try to get some content out with that. But <clears throat> this is the the chin chili, the first swilly. As you guys can see, I actually got this from Shein. She in, she in, she in, however y'all say it, but that's where I got it from. Um, as you guys can see, cute detail. Um, I think I got this for a total of like either 40 or 20 bucks. I'll put it in the description if you know if that's the thing, <laughs> but it's very comfy. Um, it doesn't I actually do got footage. Me and G got a date night on here. It's actually not as hot as y'all think it would be. And for my, my PETA people out there, no, this is not real fur. Calm down. Don't come for me and don't try to, you know, because I know how you girls like to tussle. Please don't fight me because I know how you girls like to tussle. Please don't. <laughs> Just saying. Anybody that knows me, I love green. Green is one of my favorite colors. Um, it is a fall color. Outside of green, I love um, olive green, turquoise, and all that good jazz. So, that is green is one of my favorite colors, along with purple and gold and orange. 
so yeah next you guys have seen this already um i wore this i wore this for my what is it the little what was it the little commercial that we did for my job it's a little tassel dassel i actually like this jacket i wore this in new york as well i'm actually probably I don't know if I got some footage, but if I do, I'll put it in there. If I don't, I don't. But it's kind of like a little neck. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, this is really cute. It's more so of a spring slash summer look. I personally probably would not wear this in December or the winter or the fall because it's not giving fall. But that's just me to each his own. Like I said, everybody has their own fashion sense. And I don't knock that. So if that is something that you do. By all means, baby, go ahead. Next, I have this cute little sheen. I got this jacket. Oh, and my bag, y'all. That jacket was, I think that jacket was like $19 or whatever. If I remember the price, I'll put it down there, y'all. I got so many clothes. All right, next up, I got this little number from Sheen. Actually, let me drop this down so you guys can actually get into the full detail of This is a cute little boppity bop. Um, it's, it's very thick. I will say that, but I would recommend, maybe it's me. I'm always cold. So I do double on my jackets and stuff, but here's the detail. I am five foot three. No, I'm five, four. Look, look at me lying. I'm five, four. So let me show you guys. Don't never mind my bags, don't judge me. But show you guys how low it goes. So yeah. Yeah, if you guys are looking for winter coats, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Sheen, Sheen is Sheen is that girl. It's definitely, it's definitely giving. I got majority of my little winter coats from Sheen. But I also got some of my stuff from my aunt and my mother. So I got some vintage gas up in here, baby. <laughs> Next is my leather pleather. I actually had a um, fur that went around this. A fur actually came with the jacket. I honestly don't know where it went. Um, but I got this from Forever 21 about three, four years ago. Maybe three, four years ago. And it, y'all, it's very, very warm. It's like a little cute little crop jacket. Hey, girl. Hi. <laughs> But I got this from Forever 21. This jacket was, I already remember the price. It was $54.98. Um, and no, I did not get it on sale. You probably won't get this in there no more. But they do have some, Forever 21 has some cute jackets as well. So I don't always just shop at Shein, y'all. I'm sorry. I know some people are like, dang, she cheap. No, I'm not. I do get some stuff from Forever 21 as well. I don't shop at Fashion Nova. I'm just going to be completely transparent and honest with y'all. Don't, but... It is what it is. But well, yeah, get into the detail. I've never really worn it zipped up. I wonder what it looked like zipped up. Let me see. Okay. Oh, yeah. Cute little jacket from forever 21 i would wear this all the way up until some, some of the spring because sometimes in, in spring it'd be a little cold next is my green olive green little trench it's like a mini trench i got this from i thought i got this from target but i actually got this from forever 21 um i remember it being 25 dollars when i got it um as you guys can see, I've had this jacket for, I've had this jacket for like, ooh, Christian was three. No, Christian was two when I got this jacket, and Christian's nine now, but yeah. Um, my little thing came off. I was trying to find a button so I can sew it, but I probably super blew it because, yes, I'm that type of person. We were so resourceful, and ain't nothing wrong with my jacket, baby. Still got the strings and everything. It's really, really cute, y'all. Oh, and let me show y'all. Adjustable sides, ladies. Target do actually um have some of these too. And so does Forever 21 still. But if you kind of like 
You can make this. It's so. Ooh, I'm going to do a photo shoot with this. In so many ways, y'all can make these, these jackets. Now, I can't. Mm -mm, hold on. You can't make it that tight, so. You skinny, but you ain't that skinny. But as you guys see, it didn't get the little open bag for the. Ooh. <laughs> but yeah, got this from Target. Get into the details. I mean, not Target. Got this from Forever 21. I don't want to get stuff from Target so bad. <laughs> Girl, no, stop it. Now, I ain't going to put the price on all of them because I really don't know all of them. But I do have a very good memory of Because certain scenarios and certain stories make me remember what I bought at certain moments. Next on the docket, y'all already know. So y'all, if you guys see, I mean, you can tell by the thumbnail, um, this is some vintage gas. I actually got this from my aunt. Um, she actually had this coat for, I wanna say, I'm 29 years old. My aunt has had this coat since I was in middle school. So about 15, maybe about, I said about 15 years my aunt had this coat. But I've always admired it and it is in good fashion. Y'all, it is very warm. I'm gonna show you guys the details. And of course you already know it comes with a little <laughs> rapidy wrap wrap. So I normally wear this with a um, long sleeve because it just gives me regal. Like, like when you just, when you just know you that girl, that's what it gives. Like, Anytime I put this on y'all, I, I be channeling my my British accent um, like an episode of Peppa Pig. Mommy, got to pick George, what you doing? Tell me y'all do that, let me show y'all. Y'all see that? Oh, details. Y'all see that? Okay, boom. So that make you want to say, George, mommy, George, what you doing? My shit. I probably sound like I'm on shit. I don't know how much this was. I know it was a pretty penny. I know it's worth a pretty penny now. Um, I, I think I know where this came from. Let me see where she got this from. But y'all, this is extremely cute. Got the little flappers in there so you don't get too hot. Really cute. Check the back out. Like I said, I'm 5'4". So I'll be trying to stand on my tippy toes. If I'm this is a, ooh, Steve Madden. Actually, this is a Steve Madden, guys. So shout out to Steve Madden. Next we have, I call this my 101 Dalmatian. Although it's not polka dot, it's pearls. But hey, it is what it is. As a posture free stretch. That is the name of the designer. I've never heard of him, but my auntie bought this. I don't know when she got this one, but she actually gave me this one, y'all. I feel like a bad boosh. I can't wait to take pictures in these, in this one either. Let me see. I got a little trench coat right here. Hi. <laughs> uh -oh. So we're gonna get into the details. Yeah. <laughs> but it's nice, y'all. I do like this. I don't, like I said, I don't know how much this is. It came from my aunt. What happens when you get, you know, family hand-me-downs and heirlooms? But get into the detail. Ooh. Yes, like. It goes into like a cream and white. I'm still gonna have to wash it because I feel like it's dirty too. Ah! <laughs> but I feel like those were the really the most important ones. The rest of them are like little blue BS jackets and sweaters. But I'm gonna show you guys this one little whoop the dude that I got from um, Sheen. Cute little 80, 98. I'm about to say 89. 98. Got this from Sheen, ladies. So if you just want like a little BS jacket, that's cool. I'm actually gonna do a photo shoot with this one as well. 
I actually still might do it today. Who knows? But this is also an option. All right, y'all. We are down to the meat and the grit. We are now about to try on my dresses. So I have dresses over here for work and then I have dresses over here. So I'm gonna show you guys this side as well. It's a little skimp because I still have some clothes to hang up. But these are some of my dresses that I have over here. And then just keep them on. I'm not really a dress person, so it's not too many dress selections that I have overall. Alright guys, I have six selections, so bear with me. We're gonna get it together though. We are gonna get it together. So the first little pick me up. A little shank that ain't that hang. Y'all actually hate this dress. I got this dress from Pretty Little Thing. I do not shop on Pretty Little Thing for this reason alone. Like, ugh, it just irks me. <laughs> this dress was, I got this dress for like $23 on Pretty Little Thing. Um, I got it when it like first dropped. It's probably lower than what it is now. But this is one of the options that I got from Pretty Little Thing. So, let's try it on. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you the reason why I do not like this dress because all night I kept having to go and I also had tape but it didn't matter um I don't know why y'all like y'all titties all out like that I don't but let's get into the detail other than that I do like the color of the dress details the sleeves so what I might do it's actually transformed this into like a shirt or something. As you can tell by the sides. Like I said, I'm 5'4". So I get you a little... It gives you a little wiggle. Um, I also don't like dresses that be like bunched up in the front. Because when you turn to the side, I have a flat stomach. But it got a little bulgy bulge. But other than that, this is what... your dress looks like <laughs> period next right, y'all so next up is in the bed of be tall no <laughs> i don't want to be calling that because it's a velvet dress but same thing but i didn't have that issue with this dress because it is velvet so it was easy for me to just go like that <laughs> um but as, as you guys can get into the detail i did get this dress from sheen It comes with this cute little, it was cute. I actually wore this for a wedding. Um, G's friend got married two years ago. Well, about to be two years ago. And this is what I wore to that wedding, as you guys can see. <laughs> Your girl was a baddie. And I ain't never been with a buddy. What's the right and the left look at that? <laughs> but I think I got this from Shein for $15. I don't be spending, I'm not, who, I'm not finna spend all that money on the clothes. No. Personally, I know. I know. But, got this cute little one too. Let me pull the camera down. So, so you guys can actually see and get into the detail. Cute, cute, cute. Yeah. I know you got something a little real that I did for date night. So. <clears throat> I wore it as a jacket. So I wore it as a jacket before, um, but I want to let people know that this is, if you if you guys caught the reel that I did for day night where I did wear this as a jacket, this is actually a dress. And it comes with this cute little tie. So then it switches it up and keeps it cute. And then it's, if you get into the detail at the bottom, you'll see the ribs. So you kind of do like these. Period. I got this from Shoe Dazzle. It was fifty dollars. Um, I highly doubt that they had this because this was back in 2019. All right, y'all. Next up is my little orange, the orange, the orange. <laughs> nah, but for real. Um, I actually got this from Pretty Little Thing. This was forty. 
forty dollars for this dress. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. And I've only worn it once. No, it was fifty dollars. Take that back. No, it was fifty dollars because I got that other dress, but I got it on sale. I doubt they still sell this, but it's nothing really fancy at all. I'm let y'all get into the detail. It's like a cute little wrap. Shitty that. And then at the bottom, at the bottom it gives you kind of that little, well, I don't know what they call this little, like a, I call this a little leaf. <laughs> but yeah, I got this from Pretty Little Thing. Like I said, I, I'm not shopping with them anymore, but this is it. Get into the details. Mwah. Alright, next ladies, we are going to get into full detail when it comes to skirts. I don't know about y'all, but I love, love, love skirts. I actually got this as a hand-me-down. This came from my aunt as well. But get into the details, y'all. I got like six skirts down there. This is a lace vintage cute little skirt. You can wear this to work, you can wear this to church. Um, honestly, you can wear this anywhere. And it's, um, <clears throat> what is it, high waist? Pencil. Cute, fashion, and real, you know, to the T. Periana. And I love the way it makes my booty look, y'all. Period. <laughs> All right, so next on the list, we got this cute little leather one, too. I have not worn, I've only worn this once. I have not worn this. And, you know, I feel like now that I'm kind of getting in my fashion bag and fashion sense, I could wear this. I actually got this from Shoe Dazzle. The, this was a total of $35.99. And it's very, very cute. Very, very lax. It is faux leather, so it's not real. Just to let y'all know that. But it's it's really cute and simple. Um, you got the little slit in the front. You can wear it in the front and the back. I personally would wear it in the front because it just gives that, you know, very sexy, cute vibes feel. Um, I would probably pair it with a nice pump, though. But yeah, y'all. I got this, like, five years ago. Wow, and I've only worn it once. So, you know, it's amazing when you go in your closet and you see things. I'm just saying. All right, if my knee's ashy, I'm sorry. But next we have this cute golden skirty work. Um, honestly, I have not worn this at all yet. Um, but I do plan on wearing this for some, maybe something cute, you know, a nice little dinner day. It don't even have to be a, like a date night, but just something cute, simple, when I just want to go out the house. But I actually like this. I got this from Shein. It was $5. And as you guys can see... Like I said, <laughs> um, like I said, I'm five four, so this is how short it is, and the material is nice. I'm gonna let y'all get into the material. Got the buttons on the side. Excuse my nails; they ugly right now, but yeah. But yeah, five dollars on Shein. I like the way it makes my legs look. All right, next up, guys, I have my yellow skirt. I've only worn this once. I actually wore it um, at a job that I used to work for, and the front desk was ha was a hater so he told me that was too short but um this is cute i got this from sheen again this was ten dollars from sheen and i like the fact that it got the little, little yellow danglies which is really really cute if you want to pair this with some stockings and a black top i'm actually going to do a reel on this so if you follow me on my social media you're welcome Last but not least, y'all, somebody asked me did I own anything other than, like, dress-up clothes or, you know, just... Do I own, basically, dress-down fashion as far as, like, sweatpants and everything? Baby, I am a tomboy at heart. So, <laughs> we're gonna get, go into these tomboy pieces. I wouldn't even call them tomboy pieces, honestly. Um, I was gonna do my shoes, but I have another video for that. But as far as my... When it comes to dressing down in my sweatpants and everything, y'all, it's lit. Hey y'all, when it comes to sweatpants, this is my fave. Like, I honestly love a cute sweatpant feature where you can... Nah, I'm just kidding. But, um, yeah. So, I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't know. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put the name right there. These actually passed. These were given to me, um, 
my boyfriend actually got these for me but they're by this designer agape 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 i don't know how to pronounce the name but we're gonna get into the detail so it has like nice little it's like a velvet like a little cream velvet color like turn it down so you guys can maybe see it but it's like a little cream velvet you got a lot of pockets a lot of storage space got some pockets right here but i love them i love the way they fit these were actually boy pants but they couldn't fit them so he gave them to me so these are actually g's i'm gonna show y'all the tag hold on so this is the designer and like I said these are men's sweatpants but this is the designer G gave me these so yeah. Alright these are from a clothing brand out in New York called Vi Richie Clothing um, by Richie Paris. I'm going to show you guys what they have on the front. So these, these are the front. This is the detail and you can actually feel on this part. It's very nice. Fabric is nice. Pocket area. And they do but no back pockets oh yeah we do got a back pocket back here i got these three years ago and that, that that's me that is all me okay haters <laughs> but yeah let's get into full detail i'm gonna pull this down so you guys can actually see but this is the knees i actually got another pair from Vibe Richie, and you can actually um, adjust the zipper as well. And I'm gonna show you guys the other pair I got. So this is my second pair that I got from the brand. I actually have a hoodie that matches the top, um, that matches the pants. But get into the details. I'm gonna show you guys this, uh, the tie dye. And I'm not gonna lie and say that this isn't an expensive brand because it is. If you look it up, you'll know, <laughs> you'll see. But of course, label on the front. I like how you have your light pink over here and then it mix in with the dark pink over here, the fuchsia. Yeah. I'm gonna show you out the uh, top. And this is the uh, top that comes with it. So it's like a little a set. And then I got some other pieces from from the clothing brand as well. Um, some of them I actually am washing. I know I wore. I'm gonna do try to do like a photo shoot in some of them, but this is one of the shirts that I actually got from Vibe Richie as well. As you guys can see, you can get into the details. So this is when I want to be on my little tomboy stuff. All right, y'all. So this jumpsuit, I actually plan on doing like a um, photo shoot in this jumpsuit alone, actually today probably. But I bought this from Romway. It's adjustable on the straps, adjustable at the front. It's very, very thin. So I'm gonna let y'all know that right now. Um, of course, she probably have it, has it as well. But we, I'm gonna pull this down. You guys can get into the details. Look at my Crocs. Maybe with some cute thigh highs or something. I don't know. Something cute. I just wanted to be different. All right, y'all. So that wraps up this vlog. I wasn't going to make it that long because at the end of the day, if I show y'all my whole closet, then what's the point? Right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Also, I want to give you guys a big shout out. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for you guys' continuing support. We have now hit 790 subscribers. Who knows? It might change. I don't know. But hey, that's a milestone for me. We are almost to 1K, guys. That is a milestone for me. I, I truly just thank you guys a lot. Everybody knows this is something that I want to do. This is my passion. But we're not going to make this a soapbox because this is not that long. But <clears throat> Make sure you guys tell a friend to tell their friends to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell, friend to tell, friend to tell, friend to tell their friends to tell their friends to tune into Simply CNC and tap 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 in. Make sure you guys hit that subscription button, hit that notification bell so you can get an update when I drop another vlog. I shall see y'all next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.